Well, what a season it's been for San Antonio High School football, but it's not over yet. Three teams have a chance to take a trip to Jerry World next week and play for a state title. The Smithson Valley Rangers are down in Corpus Christi taking on Brownsville Veterans Memorial. First possession for Smithson Valley after a punt, and Freddie Dubose ends up with it on the reverse, and he's going to get dragged down, but not before picking up a huge chunk of yards. Great play, great run. That set up another great run from their bell cow. Brad Sowersby gets to the outside and down the sideline he goes for a 29-yard touchdown. Rangers take a 7-0 lead. The defense for Smithson Valley was lights out in the first half. They quickly get the ball back to the offense. This time it's Cole Freund on the end around. He gets wrapped up, but he's in for the 17-yard score. Then in the second quarter, another Rangers stop, and it's Freund again as he knifes his way in. SV going up three scores, and the Rangers kept pouring it on with the ground game. After the defense got a pick, this score is from Daniel DeHoyos. That made it 28-0 Smithson Valley. And these guys were getting their arm workouts in tonight. Tons of push-ups for Rangers fans. Smithson Valley will play for the state championship as they win big 49-21. The Davenport Wolves up in Waco taking on Tyler Chapel Hill. The Wolves had a 7-0 lead but before Demetrius Brisbane keeps it and then speeds his way through the middle of the Davenport defense. That made it 14-7 Bulldogs. But the Wolves get an answer as Tristan Hamlin looks left and then comes back right and hits Kyler Payne. Kyler turns on the Jets, and that's his second touchdown of the game. Tyler Chapel Hill, though, has a lot of speed, too. Brisbane keeps it around the left edge. He gets pulled down at the one, but the Bulldogs would score on the next play. A great season for Davenport comes to an end as they fall 56-33. to Tomorrow, the Steel Knights will try and punch their ticket to Jerry World. They'll be taking on the Summer Creek Bulldogs. Kickoff from McLean Stadium is set for 5 o'clock.